In today's video, we're going to look at different ways we can check calculations to make sure they're correct. It's useful to know the inverse operation to check your calculations. But what does inverse mean? Inverse means the opposite. So if you had the calculation 7 add 3 equals 10, you could reverse the calculation and say 10 take away 3 equals 7. The inverse of add is subtract, and the inverse of subtract is add. Here is a number sentence. 12 add 5 equals 17. Let's look at two different ways where we could check and use the inverse operation. Tens frame and a number line. For the first method, we use a tens frame. Let's start with 12, add 5. I can see that there are 17 dots out of the 20 spaces. Let's check using the inverse operation. So we start with 17 dots. We take away 5 and we're left with 12. So the calculation is correct. For the next method, we'll use a number line to count on. We start from 12, and because we add 5, we need to jump 5 digits to the right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I've landed on 17. Let's check this by using the inverse operation. So we start from 17 and we're taking away 5, so we need to jump back 5 digits. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. We've landed on 12, which means our calculation is correct. Let's look at another example. 8 add 7 equals 15. For the first method, we'll use a tens frame. Let's start with 8, add 7. I can see that there are 15 dots out of the 20 spaces. Let's check using the inverse operation. So we start with 15 dots. We take away 7, and we're left with 8. So the calculation is correct. For the next method, we'll use a number line to count on. We start from 8, and because we add 7, we need to jump 7 digits to the right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 6, 7. I've landed on 15. Let's check this by using the inverse operation. So we start from 15 and we're taking away 7, so we need to jump back 7 digits. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We've landed on 8, which means our calculation is correct. Here's a number sentence. 19 take away 5 equals 14. What is the inverse operation? Can you check this calculation by using a tens frame? Pause the video to give you time to work out the answer. Press play when you're done. Let's see how you got on. So we need to do the inverse operation. So we start from 14 and add 5, which equals 19. So the calculation is correct.